Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Haunter, the Finnish of Mermaid. Welcome if you're new here. Uh, today is another unboxing that I will be doing. And this one, it's so shiny. But this is a Slug and Kraken. I've been wanting a Slug and Kraken piece for a while now since uh, I saw Courtney's tentacle earrings that she got from her. And I don't have pierced ears, so necklaces and stuff like that is my forte. And a very lovely uh, pod mate and friend of mine, Widget, I'll link her down below, uh, decided to help me with this. She bought it for me as a gift, and I can't thank her enough. Thank you, Widget. I know you're going to see this. So thank you. I'm so excited. But yeah, so I'm going to get into it. I can't, I can't believe how shiny this is, though. Like, and it's blue. If you guys want to get a Slug and Kraken piece for yourself, she has an Etsy shop and it's the Slug and Kraken. She makes earrings and pendants and um, these really cool, I think they're called goddess dishes. They're they're really neat, but oh, oh, I forgot she had these bags. Oh, they're so pretty. Okay, let me just make sure there's no cards. Okay, cards in here. Look at how pretty this bag is. It's like coral. Oh, cool. I'm definitely keeping mermaid treasures in this bag. But, okay. Oh, and I love her, I love her branding. Look at how cool this is. I'm gonna have to use this as a bookmark. Look at it. Yes. Oh, yes, this is a new bookmark. And then, okay, that's connected. Oh, there's another card. This is, oh, okay, that's just like the sticker. I tried to pull that out. Uh, from the depths of the ocean to the endless expanse of space, the Slug and Kraken celebrates all things weird and wonderful. Octopuses, nudibranches, jellyfish, and more collide with magical oddities, starry skies, and beach vibes, and treasures made with love and whimsy. So, yeah, if uh, that vibes with you, go check her out. The slugandkraken.com. There we go. And again, she's on Etsy. All right. Oh, so many goodies. Okay. What's this? Ooh. Thank you, Sabrina, for helping organize the koi tail gift for court. Yes. Ah. So if you guys haven't seen that, uh, what she's saying here when she says, uh, thank you for helping organize the koi tail gift for Courtney Mermaid. I hope you love this little token of, appreci of appreciation widget. Um, we, as a pod, I'm a part of Courtney Mermaid's Patreon pod. And I uh, went to widget last year in, I think it was August or September. And I said, hey, I want to do something cool for Courtney and I want to do it uh, where we make a tail and I wanted to see if you had input on this idea too and if you liked the idea of it being from the whole pod and Widget was the one who actually designed the tail and we uh, had it made from Fin Fun and we sent it to Courtney and I, I still don't know how we did it but we were able to just go under the radar the whole time. Courtney did not suspect a thing, so that was really cool. But I also don't like taking credit for things. So yes, I was the one who came up with the idea and kind of got it started, but it wouldn't have happened without the pod. So yeah, okay, uh, one more paper and then we will get to the thing, I promise. I'm trying to make it suspenseful. I don't want this to be too short, but oh yeah. So this is some of her items. So she's got her earring, oh, this side, her earrings. She's got uh, these really cool resin pieces that are earrings as well, but you can also make them pendants, pen, pen, pendants, <sighs> English. And then she's got these little resin guys that look like the actual creatures. And I want to get some of the, the mystery goldfish because you can get 
little like stud piercing ones. Um, and it, she'll just send you random colorations. And she's got these little goldfish ones that are clip-ons and just the need, the need is real. Um, oh, hey, caring for your treasure. Okay, I like that because I wanna make sure that this, this treasure lasts for a long time. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm gonna read over this later. For now, let's get into the actual treasure. And I'm gonna kind of scoot my headband down because my hair hates headbands. I love headbands, but my hair just does not. Let me scoot backwards again. All right. Da, 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 da. I love this box, I love this color. Oh, it's wrapped. There's wrapping inside the wrapping. Okay. Set this to the side. It's got, it's got a little bit of weight to it. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited to show you guys. I've been eyeballing this one for a while and I'm just, I'm so excited. There's wrapping in my wrapping in my wrapping. Okay. Thick little card. I gotta read this for you guys. Okay, this has got some lore in it. Okay, we'll get to this as soon as I read this. Okay, headband's coming off because it's already starting to look goofy right here. Okay. <clears throat> Moon and Tides. Astronomer Seleucus of Seleucia was the first scientist to admit that tides were caused by the moon in 150 BC. But Isaac Newton was the first to explain tides with gravity related to the sun, earth, and moon in 1687. Hopefully I said that astronomer's name correctly because I suck with names. Uh, tides are caused because the moon's gravity is pulling the water up while the earth's gravity is pulling the water down. The change in rotation of the earth and orbit of the moon and sun causes the very tidal actions we see. So from that, Y'all might be able to guess that, baby hairs, this is a moon or sun or earth uh, related piece, but it, it, is, it is related to the moon, but <laughs> okay. It's so pretty and I'm only seeing the back of it. Look it! Look at how gorgeous this is. Oh my goodness. Oh. And this is a resin piece. And this is custom colors. And it's a little, it's an actual little dragon figure. And then it's encased in resin so it sticks to it, it'll stay. But, oh, that is so beautiful. And I could have gone with the glow-in-the-dark version, but I really loved the color of the, the non-glow-in-the-dark dragon. Um, so I went with that one. But look at... Oh my gosh. Oh, it's so pretty, you guys. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, if you can, again, please go check her out. Even if you can't buy anything, just going over to her store and looking at her stuff is supporting her. Oh, the chain is long, nice and long. I wonder if I can put it, mm -hmm. nope, it doesn't fit over my head. Well, maybe, hold on. Cause I'm one of those people who, if I don't have to work with the clasps, I am a happy camper. So, haha. -ha. Okay, I will not be doing that again. I will be using the clasps on this. But mm, yes, oh, it's gorgeous. She gorgeous. Oh my gosh. Oh, so good. <laughs> oh man. Oh hair. Hair. 
Oh. Y'all. Huh. It's so pretty. I am in love. I am in love. I am in love. I love it. But, uh, yeah. So, I'm a huge fan of dragons. Uh, I know I talked about that a little tiny bit when I unboxed Cromwell. But, dragons are the reason I got into mermaiding. A lot of people are like, oh yeah, Splash, or Little Mermaid, or H2O. Nope. Dragons. I love dragons. And I just, oh. It's so pretty. If my camera will stop uh, readjusting itself. But. Ugh. Yes. But I love the moon. But I'm an absolute fanatic of dragons. I collect dragon figurines. I have dragon stuffies. I have so much dragon stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah. So the reason I found mermaiding through dragons is because of the Renaissance Festival and scales. I love dragon scales and dragons and the Renaissance Festival. And so I really want to get a dragon scaled tail because it draws in my origins and stuff. <laughs> But other than that, yeah, so I went to the Renaissance Festival and I'm like, dragons, dragon stuff, anywhere, dragon stuff. And I saw the Mermaid Lagoon and I'm like, huh, let's go on there. And I saw the tales and of course the Minnesota Renaissance Festival, Finfolk. The Finfolk twins are from Minnesota. And so I saw their tales and I'm like, whoa. So, yeah, and I'm like, all right, fish. I also love the ocean. Scales, dragon scales. Yes, two and two together. Also sea dragons and serpents, so. I don't know. My connections are weird, but that's also me. I'm a weird individual. But, yeah, so go check out Slugging Kraken. Thank you again, Widget, for helping me get this. This is amazing. Oh my goodness. Uh, uh, it's so good. It's it's just so pretty. She's gorgeous. She's got. Uh, Courtney says it a certain way. Um, she's uh, sparkle. It sparkles. Sparkly. Look at Slug and Kraken's stuff. It is amazing. You will probably find something that you love. Again, she does a whole slew of things, and you get to customize your pieces. So you can either get it to look like the default picture, or you can get the way you like. Yes, it is so good. Um, the next piece I want to get from her is probably either going to be the goldfish earrings, like I said. Otherwise, she's got a circle like this, a pendant. That's a circle. And it's got a dinosaur in it. And then she's, oh, but then she's also got the orca whale one. If you love orca whales, she's got an orca whale set. She's got necklace and, and, and earrings. So, oh, and then she's also got a bloody shark earrings, uh, regular water shark earrings, so it's not bloody water, but so much good stuff. So much good stuff. I absolutely recommend her. I will put her Etsy down in the link below. I'll also tag her Instagram down there too, uh, so you can follow that. If she has a Facebook or a Twitter, I'll put those down there as well. Other than that, we're done. We've done the unboxing. So let me just, let me just, let me just one more time. Show it off one more time for you guys. Look at it. Oh, it's so pretty. And the sparkle. With that, I'm going to go ahead and leave this video here. If you all liked this, go ahead and give me a like with the like button, or you can leave constructive criticism with the dislike button and a uh, comment in the comment section. I'm not gonna hate y'all. It lets me know I need to work on things and I wanna do good. I wanna learn, I wanna get better, you know? Practice makes improvement. 
other than that, you can click the subscribe button if you haven't, if you want to swim around more. And then that bell icon will also let you know when I upload my videos every Friday. So with that, I'm going to go ahead and go take a nap. And then I have to go do some errands with a merchander and hopefully get a swim in tonight. I will see y'all on the flip side. Bye, y'all.